Hello, I'm Shelly Rothis, and I'm a different kind of victim. Today is going to be story time. I'll be reading something I had written, and it's going to be based upon trust and my feelings. And then there's going to be another part based upon that topic I had brought up in the previous topic before this one. So, I'll start with the storytelling. The feeling I never knew existed. The one feeling that many claim to be like a miracle that one could never imagine if they themselves never got the chance to actually feel it firsthand. This one feeling that I thought would be something that I'd want to have ended up being the one feeling that I now hope I'd never encounter again. For this one feeling ended up being the most painful for both my mind and body. The first person I had trusted ended up doing the most cruel things that anyone with an ounce of humanity would ever imagine could possibly be done. Yet there are those without any conscience that will do these despicable cruel acts without an ounce of shame or regret. You see, the feelings were like no other I have ever gone through many times before. The pain was too big for my mind to endure. Part of my mind ended up floating up above me, trying to escape the enormous amount of pain that I knew I would not be able to ignore. For it was so real, even though it was nothing I myself could ever imagine would ever be possible to occur. I tried so hard to escape the pain that most judged as silly and meaningless. For we live in a world where most people are self-centered beings without any compassion to see another person's feelings as real. Most beings live for what appeases only what they selfishly crave without a care as for how they affect others who they encounter in the midst of their selfish ways. I walk on air as though I no longer can feel the ground beneath me. The pain I feel now is like no other pain I ever knew. It is like I have two hearts that are beating separately one just to keep me alive physically, while the other one is rapidly pounding in a rhythm that is more painful than the usual pain I have endured for most of my life. This one feeling that most claim to be a feeling that you will always crave to have is nothing but a trap full of painful feelings that I never want to risk enduring ever again. That's how I feel about trust and that feeling. The next video for part two will be describing my feelings and why I feel this way based upon the feeling of trust. So that's it for this part one of storytelling and I'll see you for part two. I'm Shelly Rothis, and I'm a different kind of victim. See you for part two.